Hold on just a second. We just had- And now we reach the inevitable. No! Life begets death. No! Ah, oh, Aceratosaurus died. That's a lot of money down the drain. No, not Spike! Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution, where we are currently chilling out with our Ceratosaurus, who's getting up close and personal with the, uh, the gate here. I reckon he's devising a way to get out. He's sick of his containment, even though he's only been in here for, like, a day or so. But look at him. He's so cool. I love his little horn on his head. I think this is my favorite dinosaur yet. In fact... He still doesn't have a name, so we gotta give this guy a name. CRT001 just doesn't cut it, I think. So let's go. We're gonna call him Sarah. I don't know. It makes sense. Ceratosaurus, Sarah. This is our Sarah after all, and it looks like Sarah might be going for a feed currently. Hold on just a second. What do you got for me, Isaac? Aha. Uh -huh. Isaac wants to make a little bit more money. What's he want? He wants me to incubate, hatch, and release at least three new dinosaurs. Three new dinosaurs. Well, 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 I guess we can do that. I guess you can twist my arm and I'll go and bring us three new dinosaurs. You know, I, I do have a quite fondness for some new dinosaurs. Let's do it. Let's get some new dinosaurs. But before we get into that, I thought it'd be cool to start this episode the same way we've started the last two. That is, of course, by asking you guys a question of the day of sorts. And that is, now that the game has been out for a little bit, how many of you own the game? And so far, which pathway have you chosen? Are you focusing on security? Are you focusing on entertainment? Or are you focusing on the sciences of hybrids and that sort of stuff? Let me know down below in the comments because I'm I'm super interested to see what more people kind of went with and what interests more people than what doesn't interest more people my English isn't very well today it's it's early it's very early in the morning over here so I'm and my, my brain is still waking up but anyways let's go we got some dinosaurs to make today so I guess that's gonna begin with us needing some some fossils so we better get some expeditions on the way and unfortunately it looks like we haven't really unlocked many new locations no I didn't want to send anyone there we've already got a ceratosaurus we don't need any more ceratosaurus DNA well doesn't look like we've got the choice I clicked it by accident again it's not the first time I've made that mistake, unfortunately, but it is what it is. Um, in fact, do they want new dinosaurs or can it just be any dinosaurs? Is there any way for me to even find out? Um, let's have a look. Research item. Oh, yeah, that's right. They want us to research the clothes shop. We can do that. That's all good. I think we've achieved all of the security missions for now, which is good. Um, and the science one is like we can't, we can't do anything to do with the science one just yet, unfortunately, I think. I'm pretty sure. Or is this what we're looking for? No, no, no. These are the contracts that we're looking at. So we can't work on this one just yet because we need to get the 3.0 upgrade, which we need to get more islands, I think, to do that. Uh, we got the big shot one, which is the... Oh, that's right. We got to get a, ca a photo of the Edmontosaurus drinking. And then there's this one here, incubate. So I don't think it matters what dinosaurs we get. I think they just want more dinosaurs. So... Maybe we can get ourselves another Edmontosaurus because, well, we got to get a photo of one of these at some stage and what better of an opportunity to do it right now. So let's get it. Oh, gosh. Bad weather. Bad weather. In fact, hold on, hold on, hold on. Who's having a, who's having a sip of water? Oh, it's Nigel. Okay. Um, we got to get that Ranger team out here. Hey, stat pronto. Let's go. Where's my Ranger team at? Here they are. Nope, that's the helicopter. My Ranger team is over here. Okay. Let's go, Ranger team one. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We gotta get a photo before the opportunity kind of is gone. What do we got going on here? Incubating a dinosaur with less than 100% genome can fail. <gasps> dinosaurs has failed to incubate. No! I never said bringing back dinosaurs was gonna be easy. Does that mean, oh no, people, people, I'm so sorry. <laughs> our ranger team are a bit erratic today. They're running over all of our visitors. Our, our, our dinosaur failed. In fact, I missed, I missed the entrance. Whoops. Let's go back, guys. We're wasting valuable... In fact, did I miss the entrance? I can't remember what the map looks like. <laughs> what does the map look like? Where's the entrance? Oh, it's over there. Okay, okay. I'm the one that's, like, losing it. My, my driving team, my ranger team. Hold on just a second. We just had... And now we reach the inevitable. No! Life begets death. No! But here's the question that you what gotta happened? ask yourself. 
Was this avoidable? He died of old yeah, age. Sure. Of course not. Of course not. It's always coming. Oh, no. But could you have delayed it? Oh, probably. Well, that's maybe another story. Oh, dear. Oh, no. That's terrible. Oh, come here, Ranger team. Where do you think you're going? We still got a photo to get. Oh, we've had our first dino death. That's so sad. And it died from old age, so there's not much we could have done about that. It must have been our first dinosaur, so I guess we got to be careful that we don't lose all of our dinosaurs that way. That would be just devastating. And I don't think our Edmontosaurus is currently drinking water anymore, unfortunately. Ugh. I guess we could resupply this while we're here. Can I just tell you guys to take a photo? Can we just add a task? Resupply the ground herbivore feeder? Not quite what I'm looking for you to do, buddy. I want you to take a photo of this guy, but that's not happening, is it? Hold on. Oh, I thought Nigel... I thought Nigel was making a run for the gate again. But no, I think he's all good. All right, well, we're too slow with the ranger team. But what we could probably do is get our... Not our expedition center. Who are back so we can send them on another run soon. Uh, no, I'm trying to get my ACU center because I need to... Um, I don't need a tranquilizer dinosaur. I just need... I need to like... I need to carry this dinosaur away to a grave or something. What do you do with a dead dinosaur? Do you bury it? Do we have a little like cemetery for them? A graveyard of sorts or not? I don't know. I would like to move... This dinosaur, please. Heading to pick up the asset. Go and get him. I don't know where to take him. Just just remove him. <laughs> just please remove him. Oh, here's our helicopter. Nice. All right, well, let's look away while that's all happening. We got some fossils to uh, extract. We can't do anything with the aquatic ma ma mammal fossils, so let's go and sell that one. We've got a little bit of Ceratosaurus. One of them's a low quality. All right, well, we'll just extract them. They're pretty cheap. We may as well go and extract them all. Why not? We'll get all three of those extracting. And there was something that they wanted us to research. Um, buildings? We want ourselves the clothes shop. So let's go and learn that. We've got to build one of them super duper soon. Um, now that that's on the way, that's pretty good. Okay, so we should get some more dinosaurs, right? That's what we've been supposed to be doing. Uh, so let's get ourselves another Struthimumimus. Considering our last one unfortunately died. And we've got a second slot in our hatching bay. And I did want another Edmontosaurus. So let's spend more money on that one there. And at least as we spend more money, I'm sure our visitors will be happy as well. I'm assuming they'll be happy. What do you mean? I failed another Things dinosaur? Here, huh? Oh my gosh. What you're doing with the place. We're spending so much money on failed dinosaur attempts. It's a 92% as well. We really... All right, well, to make sure that we don't fail this ever again, I'm sending my fossil expedition team to get me some 100% Struthimumma stuff. Go. We're getting 100% genome for that thing. Whether we like it or not, we got to get the job done. All right, and it looks like we've studied and learnt our, um, our clothes shop. Cool. So, can I fit this next to my two other stores or not? Oh, we kind of can. Like, right next to the entrance. But I did want to put a hotel out here as well. So I don't know how that's going to go. Uh, maybe we can... Oh, look at this. Perfect fit. Right there. Oh, it's marvelous. It's perfect. It's amazing. In fact, this substation is kind of in the way. So we might need to move that at some stage. But, in fact, might do that right now. Uh, where's the substation? Right there. If I were to move the substation... Like, here... If I can fit it here. Can I fit it here? Like right in there. I think that would be better. Because then we can put it, we can put it like another building, right? All right, we don't have to do it right now. We can get to that eventually. Right now it's not, I guess, of the utmost importance. How's that dinosaur going? Nice. No, I didn't. Oh, okay, fine. Let's get ourselves another Triceratops, okay? That was quite expensive. But what I did want to do. Let's keep it up. Was released Edmontosaurus number two. The little things. All right, buddy. Oh, I think he's saying that we should start playing with their genomes, get them a little bit tougher, a little bit stronger, make it so they can survive a little bit longer. I think we should too. 
<laughs> I love creating new dinosaurs. It's nice. Um, oh, it wants this us to con dinosaur, the construct was a live bait feeder? Uncovered at a site in Canada. I'll let you guess where. The T-Rex thinks oh. these are delicious. And who's to argue? Nice. Oh, oh gosh. T-Rexes apparently like to eat at Montosaurus's. I get the hint. I see what's up. Uh, so one of our missions is currently to create a live bait feeder. It's quite expensive, but I guess, you know, it'll give people a show. So let's throw one of these right in front of our little viewing station here. And I guess our Ceratosaurus here can have a nice old feed. In fact, how expensive are these guys to craft, to create, to incubate? Uh, $550,000. Is that money well spent? Maybe. But I think I want to get their genome a little bit stronger before we do that. Ooh, what's going on here? We've achieved a mission. We made a million dollars. And we've got... Hey, a Draco go? Rex unlocked? We've got a park running at maximum happiness. And our nice. numbers are up as a result. That's what makes the entertainment division That's the envy of the amazing. Rex. amazing. We get the results. That's All what right. I want to hear. When the parks are running well, our scientific research improves. Of course, I'd never tell this to Isaac directly. Cool. Heard it. Mm, I, I was going to <laughs> add. No. No. No, 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 no. Too late. Heard it. Later he heard on. it. <gasps> Look at this. We've unlocked two new locations as well. Two new locations that can give us our Draco Rex, which is apparently a herbivore. I don't know. I guess with the name Rex, I thought it was going to be a carnivore. I, that might just be a misconception, but we're going to have a new dinosaur on the way, which is pretty cool. All right, let's release our Triceratops. Welcome to Jurassic World. We're not going to watch it. In fact, we can watch it from a distance. Welcome, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Can I enter? Nope, I can't get into the hatchery. Feeder needs resupply. Oh, okay. Let's get that happening then. The in fact, thing you'll want we're probably going to need dinosaurs in your park. some more uh, ranger team to some more guys feeders. soon, right? Okay, ranger team, add task. I want you to resupply this feeder. Feeder resupply request received. Good. That's what I want to hear. How's that live bait feeder going, by the way? I guess it's happening. <laughs> I don't know. We still got one more dinosaur to, to, to one more dinosaur to create. Sorry. So I think that last dinosaur might be the Draco Rex if we get enough of that fossil um, in a second. We've got no more fossils to study right this second, though. Uh, our expedition team is currently on the run. What I wouldn't mind doing is getting us another dig team, but we gotta unlock it, and I don't really know how to do that. So I guess we gotta keep on saving up for that one. Um, and. I guess we should start researching something else. Can I study anything in the fossil department? It doesn't look like it, unfortunately. Um, genetics. Okay, we can play with our genetics a little bit. Intensive repair. Splicing this gene will increase the defense and resilience traits. Do we have something that'll let them live a little bit longer? They're all... They seem to be all attack and defense traits. So I guess they make them stronger. I suppose. Uh, medical treatments. Hookworm parasite. Oh, okay. Well, you know what? Maybe this is worth studying. At least it'll, like, prevent us from having issues along the lines of hookworm. <laughs> it'll prevent any hookworm illnesses. Oh, and I was also having a look over here before, and I wanted to have a bit of a play with this, because I didn't like this landscape. Um, it's a little bit too steep at the back. That's not quite what I was looking for. That's all good. All right, I want to, like, level this out a little bit. Like that. There we go. Are we leveling it, or are we, like, super dropping it? I think we're dropping a little bit too far, in fact. All right. Looking good. Looking good. And then we need some more water. Nice big patch of water in here. Oh, and we should probably get... You know what? Let's remove a little bit of this water through here. There we go. A bit like that. There we go. Now we're talking. Our Posteratosaurus over here is so lonely. We really gotta give him some companions soon, I think. But what's calling us in our control station? It looks like we unlock our next island at a three-star rating, which is cool. We've got a little bit more to go. And we've currently got 556 guests in here as well, which is pretty cool. Our facility rating is good. Great, great. Satisfaction is only okay. I don't know how we can increase that. Drink rating, food rating. Oh, and maybe we need some more drinks and food. It looks like they're the ones that are letting us down. So, 
I guess we should set up another drink shop? Fast food shop. We're gonna throw one further down this way. In fact, can we fit one around here somewhere or not? Like around here would be a nice spot, I think. Like right there. Perfect. Nice. So we got a little food station down this end of the park now. Hopefully that'll keep our guests happy. Um, seeing as though that seems to be the big issue that we are experiencing right now. Our Draco Rex fossils should be in, and it looks like we've actually got some amber! Nice! Let's extract both of those. There we go. We'll find out how much of the genome we get from those. And I think we'll send our expedition team straight away on another run. I want some more Draco Rex, so we're going to send them straight back there. And hopefully they'll bring me back some more dinosaur DNAs. Hopefully enough so that we can actually study this guy. Um, how are you doing? We're not getting much genome. Oh, wait, no, there we go. 20%. Yo, that's actually pretty good. The amber is amazing for getting DNA. I think it's going to give us about 30%, if not a little bit more. 28. 29. I like this a lot. This is nice. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Now, I did also want to check this over here, our database here. We've got some new things that we've learned, apparently, but I don't really know... Oh, it's because we studied some stuff. That's right. I forgot. We researched the hookworm um, medical treatment. So, we've got no more medical treatments that we can study right this second. We do have some more genetic traits, though. I guess we can learn some of these. Let's learn this one. Aggressive instincts 1.0. Oh, intuitive learning and then intensive repair. I guess intensive repair could be handy. If they lose their tails, they can regrow them. So, they're kind of getting that from like a gecko. That sounds pretty cool. All right, we're going to learn that. Nice, 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 nice. Our herbivore feeder looks like it has been restocked as well. Uh, but I think I'm going to get another one of them. Um, yeah, let's do that. Ground herbivore feeder. I'm going to put that in front of our little viewing station here so that people can actually watch. In fact, on top of this little mound right here. So that people can actually watch them, I guess, eating their food. I don't know. Sounds like a good idea to me. Um, cool, 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 cool. How's our expedition team? They're still on the run which is all good as far as I'm aware. I think we should go and get a hotel. We've saved up another $1.2 million. Um, so maybe it's time. Hmm. Perhaps we should focus on an emergency shelter before we do anything, just in case, you know, we do have some outbreaks or something. And I think I'm gonna throw this around here somewhere. It seems like a good location to do it. Right in here, I think. There we go. So it's near the entrance, it's near all of our other kind of amenity type stuff. We've got our power station, we've got our research center, our gift shop, our fast food shop, and our clothes shop. Cool. And how are our- Ooh, we've got some more fossils. We've got some rhodium that we can sell. We've also got some more- Ooh, we got 42%. I wonder if these two will like bring us that last 8% that we need. Let's go. Extract the DNA from both of those. Hopefully we can get to that 50% mark and then Finally get ourselves another dinosaur, which I'm super excited about. I think that's going to be awesome. All right, so how's our fun rating going? That's what I want to find out. Uh, reputation? No, that's not what I wanted to look into. Um, island rating. So how are we looking now? Great! Look at this. Great, great, great. Our facility rating is 4.5%. In fact, look at our star rating. We're nearly there. It's just our dinosaur rating that's letting us down. Base rating. Okay. Okay. So we need to get more dinosaurs, basically. That's fair enough. I probably agree with you. In fact, I think we may have finally unlocked our Draco Rex. We have! No, we haven't. No, we haven't. It's only at 46%. We're so close, though. I reckon this one's going to do it. Can it give us that last 2% that we need? Come on, buddy. I believe in you. One last percent is all we need. And it is... It is... It is there! We did it! Nice! We've got ourselves the Draco Rex, which is apparently a herbivore, which means we're going to be releasing it into our herbivore enclosure. Uh, where is it? There it is. I caught one of these guys in Jurassic World Alive the other day. Nice! Let's get one of these guys on the way. It doesn't look like he's going to take too long. Um, and now that our fossil team is back, we should probably send them away. Wait away. Uh, what do we want to focus on? Do we want 100% something? What are my fossils like? Oh, I can't, I can't see them. Can I see my... I want to see my dinosaur, like, progress. Alright, fine. We're going to send them to... 
Um, let's get some more Ceratosaurus stuff. Oh, okay. We got another storm as well. Great. <laughs> All right. Is that Draco Rex on the way or what? Oh, he's 50% to go. Okay, cool. Oh, that's right. While I'm here, I wanted to see. So, a Ceratosaurus is at 73%. Hopefully, this expedition brings us back what we need to get this all the way. Um, the Struth Theomimus as well. 5% to go. So, we are super duper close to getting that one, I guess, the rest of the way too. I want to see, though, in our little genome settings here, how does this work exactly? We did have a look at this right at the start, but we didn't look too much further. Oh, we can play with the colors. We can get the Savannah pattern gene, or we can get the Arid pattern gene. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Um, it, does it cost more to apply this stuff or not? It does give him an extra 25% rating, which is crazy. Okie dokie. We've got the lifespan, which looks like we can increase this stuff. Immune response, cardio strength. Um, so I guess it lets them survive a little bit longer, and some of them actually give a better rating too. And then we've got Resilience, which increases rating. Uh, what's Viability even mean? I don't know what Viability means. I think I said that recently. I gotta really look that up soon. Anyways, our Draco Rex is ready. Let's release this little guy. And we've completed yet another contract by creating three new dinosaurs. He kind of looks like a... Par no, what are they called? Apache. He looks like Apache. Little Apachesaurus. The little horned heads. You wouldn't want to get headbutt by one of these guys. How awesome. We have created life yet All again. Hail the Dragon King. The oh, yeah. Sounds so intimidating, but it's just a plant eater. <laughs> However, just I know. In case they do rule the earth again. Don't tell them I said that. How's our, our contracts are good. Our island rating. I guess we still need some more dinosaurs because it's not quite happening just yet. Or we got to start making some modifications. I think we got to. I think we got to get onto that. Our facility rating is amazing right now. We just got to get on top of dinosaur visibility. Oh, okay, okay, we can work on that. I want to take this contract. Sure. I haven't done much science too. missions yet, so Correct. this is probably a good thing. Use the expedition center to send a dig team to an exp un expedition and unearth a small or medium herbivore fossil. The type of dinosaur that would eat from a ground feeder. I've done that so Don't many times already. Pass you by. We can do it again. I'm going to send it here. We haven't searched this site yet, so it's worth a check. Um, also, I think we've got some more fossils here that we can extract. We've got some silver. Oh, making that bank. And we got some very low quality fossils here. So let's just extract them. They're not going to give us much, unfortunately, but it's better than nothing. Um, so visibility is what we got to work on. That's what people are getting upset about right now. So I guess we can throw down some more uh, viewing stations. Um, I just don't know where. I guess I could put down... Where I even are? Oh, here we go. Okay, I guess we can put one over here. I guess it lets you see like a whole nother chunk of the enclosure that we couldn't previously see and I've got to run a pathway to this so let's go and run it this way I kind of want to curve it over here to like try and save as much space as possible in fact can we can I bend this like that a little bit and then bring it in like that there we go. A nice little windy path. I don't know why, but we might be able to fit another building here. That's kind of like what I was hoping to save some space for. Um, you know what we could also do? Something I didn't even think of. Place some more trees around the place. Like, little shrubbery around our roads. We really haven't, like, I don't know, filled in some of these places that we've accidentally removed or removed to place buildings and stuff. Just make the place feel a little bit more fuller. Especially through this sort of section here. Some more trees through there would be nice, but it's all good. We'll get ourselves another viewing station up and running. Hopefully that improves our visibility a little bit. Did it? How are we looking for visibility? We're now four and a half stars. Okay, capacity. Aha. Okay. Look at that. Visibility, 88%. That's what we're talking about. Shopping rating is actually quite low. But on top of that, operational hotels. I think we want some more capacity. We also need more dinosaurs, so we got to work on that soon, too. Um, okay, so, expedition for a small or medium herbivore fossil. 
It looks like they're just returning, which means we should be able to finish up a contract any second. At least I hope so. Did we succeed? We did! And we got some more fossils. Well, let's yes, go and extract exactly these things. We needed. Well done completing that contract. Oh, any time. In fact, we've just increased our science thing a little bit. Oh, what's going on? Oh, okay. I thought maybe we had like another island that we just unlocked, but unfortunately not. For you to consider. Okay. It'll allow us to work together to create life. I'll be Pure happy to do that. Life. If you've been listening to Dr. Malcolm, then you let's know get some Triceratops DNA. I think I've already got that though, don't I? Incubate and release a 50% genome. I've already got 50% Triceratops. I'm well ahead of you, baby. Let's go. In fact, let's modify it a little bit. We got to make them more interesting, right? We got some skins. Let's give it um, Alpine. Arid. Let's give it Arid. Now let's give it Alpine. Alpine sounds cool. Okay. I know. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Should we give it... Oh. Viability is the chances of it actually succeeding. We are making great strides so, so by reducing the viability, the we reduce the chance of it actually spawning correctly. All right, let's do it. <laughs> uh, that's all we can adjust for this guy here. All right. So. Can I adjust this? We're going Alpine, apply that, and we're going this one. Cool. So let's get ourselves some crazy Triceratops. Um, also, what needs feeding? What needs filling? Oh, our feeder. Okay. Now, is it any point in me filling this or do we just destroy it? Because we, we currently do have our live bait feeder over here as well. I think I'm just going to destroy this one. Because I don't really need it. We've got two feeders for one dinosaur. Seems a little bit redundant. Let's get rid of that one there. In fact, yeah, there's my Ceratosaurus. There's Sarah. I thought he was hiding. Nah, it's all good. All right, how's our fossils coming along, by the way? They're all studied up. In fact, how did that affect our percentages over here? We've got 95% on the Struthiomimus, 76 on the Ceratosaurus now. Okay, which means I'm going to send my DNA expedition team to... I really want some better... Oh, they're all partially depleted. That's why they're not really giving me much stuff. Oh, okay, that makes sense. <clears throat> We've partially depleted, like, all of the DNA from these areas, except for one. That one there. No, that's partially depleted too! <laughs> I think because we've visited them all, they don't really have much DNA left in them, which is why we're only getting bad DNA now. Oh well, it don't matter. Let's go. We'll send another expedition team out. Hopefully they bring us something nice. Um, oh, and we should be researching stuff, shouldn't we? I nearly forgot. I keep forgetting to research stuff. So what can we upgrade now? We can reduce upkeep. Oh, okay. So it reduces the cost of power by 10%. We can, um, a scheduled unit enables one additional task to be assigned. Oh, okay. That's kind of cool, I guess. We can increase the accuracy of our, of our uh, tranquilizer teams, um, or we can fix up our ranges. Can we give them special tasks like taking photos of things? Or is it just medicated type stuff? Yeah. And rifle stuff. I don't know. I'm not super interested in all of that stuff. But I think it would be handy to get some electrified fences. So let's go and study that. Is our trike ready to come out? He is! This is going to... Oh, actually. He actually came out alive. All right, let's go. I'm excited about this. Because he's going to have a different skin to our other trike. He's got the alpine skin. I'm going to call this guy... Alfie, because he's an alpine dinosaur. Cheers, baby. There we go. All right. Nice. Our new specimens. Sorry, dinosaurs. Meeting expectations. Oh, you bet they are. To thrive. Oh boy. Next assignment. Making sure our specimens are properly cared for. Oh wow. words, dinosaur welfare. The I've difference just... with dinosaurs is that they have no point of reference to understand humans, so don't expect much in the way of thank yous. <laughs> oh, I won't. Uh, but I've just noticed. Oh, well, you can I'm see the color difference between the two. Oh, Henry Wu! And I'm a little disappointed that Dr. Dua came to you for this assignment instead of bringing me into the loop as she should have done. Okay. I'll discuss this with her later. 
Oh, she's in trouble. She's in trouble. <laughs> so it looks like our next mission is to get the Triceratops to 70%. Um, and unfortunately, it looks like our security rating has dropped quite a bit. Why is this? I don't know. I guess we're spreading ourselves across like everything at the moment. So I guess we got to like, I don't know, maybe increase security a little bit. We've got some radium. Let's sell that. We've got some skin impressioned. Okay, we'll sell that as well. Um, and we've got some medium quality stuff here. So let's go and extract both of these. Why not? In fact, I thought I was studying Edmontosaurus. Sorry, the uh, Ceratosaurus, not the Edmontosaurus. But it wants us to focus now on the Triceratops DNA. So we can do that. Is there a specialized place for that? There isn't. So we're just going to have to go to a generic place to do that. That may actually be hard to do. I guess we're going to go here. Problem is, it's gonna possibly bring us some Draco Rex instead. But hopefully, it brings us the the Triceratops stuff instead. Okay, so how are we doing for this? The water. This guy needs water soon. So do I try and get my my Ranger crew over here to make the most of it, or do we just not worry? Also, I do want to have a look with our new dinosaur. Ooh, our island rating is nearly at three percent. Um, our capacity is hurting us again. That's a little bit disappointing, but our dinosaurs, are we, are we doing good or not? Base rating, I guess that looks okay, but it's nowhere near five stars. Authenticity is good, modifications, I'm getting there. I don't know, this combat stuff. I don't want my dinosaurs to combat. What do they want? Do they want us to fight some dinosaurs? Do they want me to introduce a herbivore into our carnivore enclosure? Is that what they want? I don't know. But I think my last duty of today is we're going to bring in another Ceratosaurus, except I'm going to modify this one. Let's give him some, some different skin, I suppose. Let's, ooh, he's got a lot of different resilience that we can play with here. Robust, intensive repair. Can I apply all of them or just one? Just one of these. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So, which one's going to give us the best rating? Plus 2%, plus 8%, plus 9%. That's what I'm talking about. Give him some shark DNA. And that's about all that we can play with right now. So let's go incubate a $742,000 Ceratosaurus. But thankfully, we got a lot of money to do it with, so it don't matter. And it looks like we've got our electrified light steel fences, which is good. I don't know how much better these are as opposed to regular fences. In fact, where are they? Oh, it's in here. Oh, there we go, and we can choose the different... Oh, but they, of course, they need to be powered, don't they? Oh, that's going to be interesting. I might hold off on laying those out for now. We'll see how we go in that department. And it looks like our expedition team is currently returning back to base, which is quite nice. What fossils did they bring me? Nothing yet. <laughs> I jumped the gun a little bit, I think. There we go. So we've got Amber for Triceratops extracted, baby. We're going to sell that one. Um, amphibian fossils, sell that as well. And then we've got low quality Draco Rex stuff. Oh, do we sell it? Do I sell it? I'm just going to sell it. Could do with a little bit of extra money. Okay, so we got to get this to 70%. I don't think this is going to be enough to do it. It's going to get us to about 65%, I think. 66. So we still got to get a little bit more Triceratops genome DNA stuff. Uh, but in good time. In good time. It'll happen. Ooh. We can always use a few more resources. Here's our chance to earn some. Okay. It wants me to get... Extract new DNA in the fossil center. Increase the dinosaur genome to 50%. I mean, that's all good and well, but... Every dinosaur that I have access to is already well past 50%. So that's going to be a hard one to accomplish until we find another dinosaur, which I don't think we're going to be able to do for a little bit. Purely because I don't really have any abilities to do it. None of my contracts or anything even give me that ability or, yeah, reward me with that. So I guess we just got to wait and see what happens. Ah, oh, Aceratosaurus died. That's a lot of money down the drain. We literally just tipped $750,000 down the drain. Fine, I'll incubate another one. This is a one and a half million dollar dinosaur that we're creating now, which blows my mind. So much money. Ooh, I nearly forgot to give this guy here a name. Our other trike. He's going to be called Alf Alfie, wasn't it? Alfie? Alfie. 
Alfie. How do you even spell Alfie? Alfie. That's his name because he's the Alpine. I don't know why Alfie and Alpine have anything to do with one another, but that's what his name is. That's Alfie. And on that note, I think this is a good time to end this video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you did enjoy it. We've just... <laughs> oh, no. No, not Spike. Spike died. Oh, well, that's, that's ending this episode on a very morbid note. Well, guys, I'm... A little sad so i'm gonna go now thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy the video make sure to go ahead punch those thumbs ups make it rain those thumbs ups and you know spam f to pay respects in the comments down below but on that note guys i'll catch you in the next one very very soon <laughs> bye bye for now